welcome back to another video and today today we are at the end of the year of course we are continuing our lists we've done the comic book movies we've done the worst we've done the best we've done them all but today on this new year I don't know if this is going up on New Year's. I don't think it is. I think it may be going up on the 30th. I'm not positive. We'll see. I don't know. It'll be up sometime around New Year's. Um, but with it being around 2019, it's of course time to give you guys my top 10 most anticipated movies for 2019. This will be a bit of a shorter video because I don't have anything to really talk about. I'm just going to talk about the movies and it'll be pretty quick. So I have two honorable mentions and then we'll get into the top 10. So we will start with the first honorable mention. And the first honorable mention is You Are My Friend. Tom Cruise as, no, not Tom Cruise, Tom Hanks. What am I saying? Tom Hanks as Mr. Rogers. I mean, name a better duo, I will wait. I think that this movie is going to be absolutely fantastic. I cannot wait. And yeah, uh, won't, uh, you are my friend. That's pretty much it. That's all I'm really going to say. Coming in, my second honorable mention is Shazam. Now, after the absolute hit, in my opinion, of Aquaman, this movie looks fantastic i think dc is going to be coming out with another hit in shazam aquaman got people excited for dc shazam is going to keep the hype going um zachary levi as the main character is fantastic the trailers look incredible i am so so excited for this movie it's going to be great and yeah that is my second honorable mention Coming in number 10 is The Lion King. Now, I knew this was coming out, but I didn't really have any hype around it until I saw the trailer. The trailer looks phenomenal. Uh, this movie is one of my predictions to make $2 billion next year. I think it's going to be a smash hit. Disney is going to have a gigantic year next year. That is my number 10 and most anticipated movie of 2019. Coming in at number 9 is Captain Marvel, another Disney movie. You guys are going to see a theme. Another Disney movie, Captain Marvel, the first MCU movie to come out next year in March. Brie Larson looks absolutely amazing as Captain Marvel. I think she is perfect for the role, the most powerful person in the MCU. This movie is going to be fantastic. The trailers have been incredible. This is the perfect lead-up to Avengers Endgame, and... It's going to be great. I am really looking forward to it. Coming in at number eight is Cold Pursuit. Now, if a lot of you don't know about this movie, it's not the bigger, biggest release that's coming out next year, but it is Liam Neeson doing some taken stuff, uh, beating up a bunch of bad guys and getting revenge on for his son. Um, I think it looks absolutely incredible. He's the um, citizen of the year in his town. He drives a snowplow and he goes and is like goes all taken on everyone and it's an absolute revenge film and i am very excited i think it's going to be a lot of fun it's going to be a lot very action-packed and it's going to be absolutely great coming in number seven is the joker joaquin phoenix as the joker i've seen the photos they look absolutely fantastic i think this movie is going to be a lot of fun a joker solo movie i mean that's just a really interesting idea that i've never thought about one of the biggest villains in all of the comic books and superheroes and he's getting his own solo movie and i think it's going to be a great time it's going to be a lot of fun and i'm really really looking forward to this movie that's why it's at number seven on my list. Coming number six is The Best of Enemies. Now, you guys know from my top ten list that I like a lot of biopic -y type films. And this one is no different. The trailers look absolutely fantastic. I am very excited about this movie. I think it's going to have a lot of heart and a lot of soul. It's going to be great. And I'm really looking forward to it. Coming in number five is Spider-Man Far From Home, the second MCU movie on this list. You know, I think all three will probably be on, wink wink. I mean, the other one's probably a little bit up, up a little higher. Um, but Spider-Man Far From Home, of course, Tom Holland back. Tom Holland is Spider-Man. He is the perfect Peter Parker, in my opinion. I wouldn't have it any other way. I'm very happy about it. I am so excited to see what happens to Spider-Man after the events of Avengers Endgame. Coming number four is John Wick 3. Keanu Reeves as John Wick. My gosh, isn't it phenomenal? Those movies are a lot of fun, very action packed. It's just that I just love the John Wick movies. And John Wick 3, him on a horse. 
riding through a city. I think it's New York. I'm not sure. But him on a horse in the rain. Uh, those set photos are absolutely hilarious. I love it so much. Um, he's kind of a meme at this point to me, but the John Wick movies are awesome. I would not want to come face to face with John Wick in a dark alley because I would not come out successful. I will tell you that right now. But the memes aside, I am very excited for this movie. I think it's going to be awesome. It's going to be very jam-packed. There was a big kind of cliffhanger set up for the next movie at the end of John Wick Chapter 2. I'm very interested to see how he gets out of this bind. Command number three is Star Wars Episode Nine. We do not have a trailer. We do not have a name. But it's Star Wars. It's the end of this trilogy. It's pretty much the end of the Skywalkers. That's This is pretty much like the wrap in a bow up of the Skywalker kind of um, thing. And I'm... Really looking forward to it. I loved The Last Jedi. I loved um, The Force Awakens. I just, I cannot wait to see where they go from here. Adam Driver, again, we talked about him in Black Klansman, and my favorites of 2018. He's great as Kylo Ren. I'm very excited for this movie. Coming in number two is Toy Story 4. My gosh, my childhood was Monsters, Inc., The Incredibles, and the Toy Story movies. I absolutely adored the first three Toy Stories. The third one was tearing at my heartstrings, and the fourth one is expected to do nothing different. I am very excited for this. The trailers look great. I mean, they're teaser trailers. You really can't take much from them, but I think this movie is going to be absolutely fantastic. It's going to make everyone cry and be emotional, and I'm ready to cry. I really am. This movie is going to be so great, and that is my number two most anticipated movie of 2019. And coming in at number one, everyone already knows it is Avengers Endgame. Oh my gosh, this is it. This is it. It Avengers Endgame. We find out what happened after the dusting, after everyone, all of, we saw most of our heroes fade to dust. We are going to find out how the Avengers fix it. This is a bookend on the MCU. Iron Man opened up the book. This is ending the book for this realm of the MCU. Obviously, the MCU is not going anywhere, but this is the end of it for a lot of different storylines. A lot's going to be paid off in this movie. Don't you just love payoff in a movie? It's like the best. And this movie is just a walking payoff. That's what this movie is. I'm really looking forward to seeing Steve Rogers and Tony Stark get back together and team up. I really want them to mend that broken friendship. And in the end, I think one of our favorite Avengers is going to die. I will not tell you who. I will be doing a prediction video before the movie comes out in April. But Avengers Endgame, I mean, it's incredible. So that is it. That is my ranking of my most anticipated for 2019. Let's just count real quick. How many of the top 10 are Disney? One, two, three, four, five, six, six. Disney, you have a monopoly on my movie watching. It's absolutely insane. But you know what? They make, in my opinion, my favorite movies. They make my favorite movies. What can I say? Um, so I'm so excited for 2019. It is destined to be an incredible year for movies. I think it's going to be so much fun. These are only 12 of the movies that I have my eye out. There are going to be a bunch more. I am so excited for this next year in movies. Let me know down below what your most anticipated movie for 2019 is. I'm assuming a lot of you it's Avengers Endgame. Some of you something else. Let me know down below. I'd love to talk to you guys in the comments about your favorite movie for next year. But that's pretty much it guys. Again, like, comment, subscribe. Thank you for watching. We'll see you in the next video and have a great rest of your day.